Hey, what is up guys? Here with 15 Cydia tweaks and themes for your iPhone 5. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into the 15 Cydia tweaks and themes. Now this first Cydia tweak that we have is called Barrel. And I'm sure you guys are pretty familiar with it. And what it does is add a sliding animation when you slide your page over. We do have different animations that you can change to a inside of a cube, um, a circle rotation. This is one of my favorites, which is the curl and roll away. Next up, number two is the theme that I have running here, which is one Intox VIP i5. I'm gonna go ahead and drop all the names of the tweaks and themes down in the description. Now, in my opinion, this actually offers up two different looks here. First off, we have a transformer look. And second off, we have a 3D box effect, which is actually what it's supposed to be. So what it does is it takes your icon and places it inside of a box and gives it a front and two side panels, which makes it look 3D. But in my opinion, and to everybody that I've shown, this also looks very similar to transformer icons. Next up is lightsaber sounds. What this tweak is going to do is give you a lightsaber sounding effect when you open and close your phone. So let's go ahead and close the phone off and you can hear the lightsaber sound. And let's go ahead and turn it back on. Once again, guys, that is lightsaber sounds. Next up, we have OXO. And what OXO does is it allows you to have a full page multi-app switcher, an actual real-time page of where you left the application off at. And this also gives you a different style music player as well. To dismiss an application, all you need to do is swipe down. Or you can long hold one icon and I'll give you the option to remove all applications from the multitasking tray. Next up is number five and it is Now Now. And what this tweet does is allows you to add Google Now to your personal assistance and you can set it up for different ways to initiate it. What I did was I initiate it by hitting the home button three times simultaneously. You can see it immediately goes to Google. All I do is tap the voice. What is the weather like in Sacramento? It's 77 degrees and clear in Sacramento. Next, number six is Jelly Lock. What this tweak does is give you the ability to have a jelly bean type unlock screen. You can see here I have five different unlocking options just like you would on Android 4.2 Jelly Bean. Next, number seven is Activator. And what Activator does is it's pretty much an essential tweak that you need to get if you're going to be doing anything that has to do with Winterboard. And what this does is allows you to set different functionalities. I can select here to go to Triple Press and every time I triple press the device it'll go to the actual functionality that I program it to like for instance right now I have it on if I tap it three times it will go to now now next number eight is message box and what this does is allows you to keep your chat heads open when you go back to your home screen so you can see here I'm on my home screen and you can see my chat head actually appeared here on the side and I am able to move it around and uh, put it on either side of the page up at the top. I'm able to move it towards the bottom as well as get rid of the entire chat head itself. Next up we have Zeppelin. What Zeppelin does is allows you to change your carrier logo. You can see right now I have it set to Apple which gives me an Apple logo up at the top instead of an AT&T logo. But we have everything down here from Batman to uh, Beats by Dre all the way down to a Superman and a Nike logo. Once again this is a pretty awesome tweak and this is called Zeppelin. The next tweak I'm going to show you is called SB Settings. You can see here that SB Settings provides a couple of essential toggles. You have your Bluetooth, your brightness, your Wi-Fi on and off toggle, as well as a respring and a power button available, and that is available via SB Settings. Next up is Harlem Shake, and to initiate the Harlem Shake, all we need to do is shake the device. And next up we have a Cydia tweak that is essential to everybody who has jailbroken their device. Everybody needs to have Winterboard on their device if you're into selecting different themes as well as different customizations as far as adding extensions and even further tweaks to the already tweaks that you have installed on your phone. You can see here that you have the option to select themes. You can hide your Winterboard. You can turn on Summerboard. We also have an advanced option for advanced themers. Next up, number 13 is ProTube. And ProTube is the way YouTube should have actually been brought to the iOS application and platform. What this does is allows you to have way more settings and way more functionality just like you would on the desktop version of YouTube. 
Let's go ahead and click on the tab on the side. You can see that we do have different settings, including the option to go directly into your inbox and respond to comments, which in my opinion is a very useful feature. Next up is iSwipe, and what this does is give you an option to swipe on the keyboard, just like you have the option on an Android or a BlackBerry device. Now I'm going to go ahead and use iSwipe to type the word subscribe. Let's go ahead and see how accurately it works. You can see here it says subscribe and it worked very good and also gave me a couple other options here to choose from as well. Number 15 is the current theme I have here on the iPhone 5 which is called Carbon X. And what this does is give you a very flat looking theme just like iOS 7 is supposed to be. It physically changes some of the applications such as the settings, messages app, the phone, Cydia as well as Safari. This has been 15 Cydia tweaks and themes for your iPhone 5. Now if you're not sure how to jailbreak your device, I'm going to go ahead and drop a link down in the description so you can go ahead and follow the step-by-step -step instructional video that I made to help you jailbreak your device. Leave down in the comments section your favorite city of tweaks. Also let me know down in the comments section if you guys would like to see 15 more. Be sure to leave a thumbs up down below, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys on the next one.